Hello Libra, this is your January mid-month <clears throat> Celtic Cross reading with clarifiers. <clears throat> Six of Wands, Eight of Swords crossing that. Seems like you may have some unnecessary stresses on your mind that you're giving yourself. Your current uh, thoughts are some of impatience, but you're, you're happier not sitting around. Your current situation, Six of Wands, everyone's loving you. Everyone in the grandma's loving you. You're loving yourself. Everything is looking all right. In your recent past, you're already looking towards the future. You're doing great. Uh, in your near future, you may have some kind of heartbreak or loss coming up, Three of Swords. Your current focus right now is that you're not waiting around for anything and you're moving on to new things. You have your ex on your mind with Six of Cups on the bottom of the deck, Judgment in Reverse. You feel like uh, no one's helping you get back your ex back, but you're listening to your intuition, High Priestess, under that. Thinks you could be that, it could be, that could be your situation or it could be your ex's situation if that's the two energies involved here. Um, See, a lot of fire, a lot of wands here, a lot of cups here, a lot of, um, a lot, a lot, a lot, man. Yeah. Some air energy here with the Three of Swords. You might have a heartbreak soon and think about your ex. Hmm. What you're thinking about yourself right now is the sun. You're feeling untouchable in that department. In the happiness department, you're feeling untouchable. You feel like you really got it. You're really feeling like a winner. Um... With people thinking about you, that you're being closed off, you're not coming out to hang or anything. But you're in the sun, you don't need people right now. You're feeling great about it, Libra. King of Pentacles in reverse and your advice. This might mean to uh, be careful with your stability. You're advised to not uh, rush into anything. You could be reckless and being impatient and make a quick decision without thinking it through, and that might risk your stability, right? And the two of wands in reverse in your outcome. It seems like you're going to be at a crossroads with this whole three of swords thing up here. All right, let's get you some clarifiers. On the bottom of the deck, yeah, I explained that already. Let's get you some clarifiers real quick, right? Let's see one card for each of these positions. What's going on in Libra's life? Uh, Six of Wands, the Fool in Reverse. It seems like you've been sticking to your old gut intuitions and that's been working out better for your life. When it comes to the Eight of Swords crossing that, you had the death, you made a necessary change that uh, took you in a better direction in your life. Scorpio energy. Um, with the thoughts of your impatience, you have the Knight of Wands. You're thinking about um, just having some flings, maybe. But you're not really um, acting on that right now. W what about the Five of Cups in reverse? You have the Nine of Cups. So, maybe in your past you were thinking about the past a lot. But now you're thinking about the future. In your even recent past, you were thinking about the future only. And it's been working better out for your life. Okay, that's too many there. Let's see what's going on. Let me see. Nine of Cups, also in the past. So, you were really having a ball, and it wasn't a deteriorating you at all. Your life was going great. Perfect, almost, even. You were looking forward to the future, and now this big change came, and for some reason, Three of Swords is there, you know? For the Three of Wands here. Oh, and there's three, three Swords here, Three Wands here, then Three of Wands in reverse, and Two of Swords air energy there. Maybe someone cheated. There was a third party involved. I'm guessing that there was a third party involved. A lot of, a lot of things. But you were, you were always in your power, though, there, with the Knight of Cu Nine of Cups in uh, the upright position. Clarifying the Five of Cups in reverse. You were always doing things, seems the right. And there's Three of Swords there. It's clarified by the Five of Pentacles in reverse. That's telling me, like, you uh, were feeling better about that situation. Or you're feeling better now. Uh, but... Yeah, 
you're feeling the sun, but deep inside you might feel like sad about your relationship status. It might be like that. You still feel played by what happened. Three, three of pentacles. Clarify three of pentacles. Why is my Libra not going outside anymore? Uh, four of wands. They wanted a happy, stable home still. That's what it's telling me. That's what it's telling me. Clarify this king of pentacles. Reverse three cards. Let me see what's really going on with this earth energy. It seems like that's the guy. It's like saying to leave this guy, this earth energy. Uh, <clears throat> Seven of Pentacles reversed. You waited for them to show you better results, but it never happened. The Hermit, you went inside of yourself. Virgo and en Virgo and energy. You went inside yourself and found out that realized that this guy is not as good as uh, you thought he was. Emperor reverse. He's not stable in terms of his emotions or maybe in his fortune, because it is the King of Pentacles reverse. Seems like you were dealing with a fraud. I guess you know. I don't pull no punches on this channel. Whatever. Two of uh, Wands, Reverse. What is uh, my Libra's outcome? Clarify, I want three cards for that. I want to know why Libra is going to be at an indecision. Because you got two of Swords and two of Wands there. That's definitely something like that. Four of Pentacles. You're going to be in indecision because you're still clingy. Three of Pentacles. You want to start it over and make something new. Oh gosh, this reading can go on forever. What's on the bottom of the deck? Let me see here. Eight of Pentacles reverse, because you don't want to give up on all the things you've invested on him with this person. Page of Pentacles, because they apologize, possibly. He was a king of Pentacles reverse, now he's coming back as a Page of Pentacles and apologizing to you. With a, a true cup of love. So, so you can't Scorpio Pisces, but it's going to be unsuccessful at the end, unfortunately. Six of Wands reverse. Sorry, Libra. That is what it is. Take care.